Let's roll and see what you get. Oh! Oh, no! Are you kidding me? Oh this is gonna probably be gross. This is gonna be strong. <laughs> Scrumptious. Oh, I can smell it. I'm really grossed out right now. Aha! Uh -huh. Whoa, what is this? <laughs> bag of chips? How many chips are left in that bag? Let's see, reach in there. Just Boy. crumbs. <laughs> you ate the whole bag? Welcome back to the YouTube, YouTube family. family and Toto and the dogs. Okay, so we are continuing our winter survival challenge. These are made up scenarios for our area. We thought it would be kind of fun to see if we could survive different challenges. Day one was interesting, but we survived. Cause yep. it's day one. I mean, how hard is day one? The boys were shopping for what? our month's groceries. That? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, if you haven't seen it, you gotta go back and watch to see what we're eating for the next month. Oh goodness. Anyway. But it's still here, right? So we still have Yeah, it's still the happening. No fuel. So we, we still have to watch out what we're doing when it comes to driving. Cause we gotta be we have super to be very careful. careful. Okay, so we're gonna draw another scenario today and find out what we're doing. Yesterday, Jake pulled from the bottom over on this side. And I'm thinking Katie is thinking now that she'll mix it up. <laughs> Because Katie put down all the scenarios here. And I don't want to pick a really tough one because I don't know. I'm you just not ready for a tough one. one. Early on, you want to save tough ones for the end? I don't know. Okay, Jake, what color is speaking to you? Pink, white, yellow, or green, or purple? I'm seeing only one purple. So, so purple. I want purple. 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 You guys want purple? Maybe that's the hardest right, so one. So if you guys want purple, I'm going to go Wait, with this top white one. one. No, I picked no. it already. I picked it. I picked no. it. I picked it. All right. So if you guys want to see what's in the purple one like the boys do, comment down below and we will pick the purple but I picked the top white there are three whites I picked the top one I'm hoping that's the degree oh the no oh no there's a pink slip inside pink slips are never good oh, boy. oh lots of words okay it says mom thinks someone is eating all the snacks <laughs> And is worried we are going to run out before the month is over. Don't be worried. Yeah, we will. Record every single thing you eat or drink for the entire day, even if that is a piece of gum. So wait, so we got to journal everything we eat? You have to video journal because I want these guys to Everybody's going to see how crappy I eat. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay, no. so I don't want to run out of comfort food, okay, by the end of the month. And you guys are eating them like crazy. So we're gonna jot down everything. You get to see what we all eat in a day, except for, I'm gonna say, you don't have to record your water because you could just get that out of the tap. That's not like, I'm not worried about running out of water at this point. Um, so no. you can Turn just record all your food. <laughs> okay, so this gives me a great idea that we should actually play a game to maybe enhance our last Junk food day. It's gonna involve Oreos. It's Plus, gonna involve. Wait, junk food day. I'm trying to find out who's eating it's all gonna the involve, junk food. Okay. That's gonna be the most junk food. I'm gonna I'm admit. Like I've got an open package of Oreos sitting on the oh side my. of my bed. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna share with everybody, but we're gonna play an Oreo dunking game. Mom, I think I found the culprit. All right, you guys ready? Okay, guys. Mom says we have to record the items. That's our challenge for today, like you guys know. And one of the items I'm gonna be eating is a noodle bowl kind of thing kind of like a stir fry it's really good i have to cook it up for three minutes and that's one of the items okay guys so i finished my noodle bowl it looks like this it's really yummy i forgot that i'm gonna be using some soy sauce with it because you need soy sauce with noodles and i'm also drinking a cream dr pepper which i almost forgot to record that so good thing i did okay i've been really good since we uncovered what our new challenge is for the day i haven't eaten anything so normally i snack on a few things and you're probably gonna see a few uh, sneaky sneakies that i pull throughout the day to get this so but i want to first show what i'm gonna have for lunch yesterday katie bought the pizza and Jake and Ty went to the store and got soda. <laughs> I don't want anything to go to waste, so I'm gonna try and eat the pizza for lunch. Now, this is one day old. It's been in the fridge, it's cold. Here's my question to you guys. So there it is right there. It's thin crust pizza, it's not the thick. So, do you guys like your pizza on the second day cold or do you warm it up? I know there's an ongoing debate. It's almost like, is a pineapple a supposed to be on pizza? And a lot of people say no, that it should never be there. Other people say it's the best ever. Here's my question. Hot or cold? Because I think I like it either way, but today because thin crust, it is snowing outside. We're gonna warm it up for 30 seconds, give it a little bit of heat. But here's the other piece. When it comes to the drinks, 
So you see, yesterday, Jake and Ty bought this weird Mountain Dew fruit quake. I've never had it before. Fruit quake makes me kind of think like, this is gonna give Katie ideas that we're gonna have an earthquake coming up soon. It sounds like cereal. <laughs> it does kind of sound like cereal, like, and it kind of looks like it. Like, should I be putting this on cereal? Should I have the fruit quake? Or should I just go with the classic Mountain Dew? Mountain Dew is my favorite drink <laughs> of choice, and I always tend to lean this way. But I think I'm gonna try the fruit quake, and let's just put it this way. If I don't like it, I'm gonna go with the old reliable. My entry right now, semi-cold pizza and a soda. Okay, David and I must have got hungry at the same time. That or else I could sense that he was about to eat lunch and I, and Ty too. It's lunchtime, we're all hungry I guess. Maybe it's not a sensey thing. But my plan was, because I couldn't stop thinking about that miracle dressing that the boys bought at the store, it made me crave a tuna sandwich because I made fresh baked bread last night. So I was thinking I was gonna have a tuna sandwich, but all I could find in our pantry was canned chicken. I just realized we have no tuna canned tuna in the house. We have a couple tuna kits that are like the tuna and crackers. So that once we can shop again, tuna, canned tuna is definitely on my list because I thought we had a lot of it. Where did our tuna go? You threw it away. Remember did I it throw it away because it was expired? Yeah, oh, I was like, I swear we had tuna. I probably would have eaten the expired tuna if we had it. But I came upstairs to make my canned chicken sandwich and I saw David has the pizza out and I think it would be smarter if we ate pizza instead of breaking into something that could last. Like this doesn't expire until October. So this would be something that I would save and that we should probably eat the pizza since it will go bad a lot quicker. So I'm switching. I'm gonna have pizza for lunch. I was gonna do chips with this, but Chips doesn't go with pizza. I don't eat pizza and chips ever. I already had a soda this morning before we started this. And so I think I'm just gonna have some water with some pizza, maybe two slices of pizza. Lunch. There's their lunch. So we do thin crust. We've all become fans of thin crust pizza when we order it. However, when we make our own, we just do it according to everybody makes their own pizza. So some is chunky and some's not. I don't know if I like thin crust as much. So Ty like noticed thin. that on the can it says fruit quake here, but it, down here it says it's got fruit cake flavors. And it is, it's like super fruity. I don't know if I like it. I mean, I'll drink it. I'm not gonna throw it out because I mean- We can't. Nobody wastes an Mountain Dew, but still. Definitely not now. Don't think we'll ever buy one again. Don't, don't buy this flavor again. I really like that purple one that they make at a certain time of the year, like the midnight lightning. Like the Halloween one or what? Yeah, I think it's around Halloween. All right, so here's my box of Oreos that I'm willing to share with everybody. Now granted, you see a lot missing. I did not eat all those. No, I just had, had a few of them. Time. So we've had these for a while. These just happen to be a snack. Tired. So what I thought we'd do as we're kind of here in this, I don't know, I don't know. I wouldn't say we're locked down, but we can't really go anywhere because we Audrey don't waste out of our fuel. Audrey she came used her up. fuel. <laughs> okay, she's not on the same level as us. And so if today's our eating challenge, I thought this would fit perfect. So I saw this on TikTok where you can roll the Oreo down and then at the bottom you have either rewards or punishments. We're gonna do two rounds. This is the reward round. So you roll it down. Just because you start it here doesn't mean it's gonna end here. It could go off anywhere at because these Oreos are not we're completely walking. round and they're not like set perfectly running. either. So they're like lean. But you could get a reward by getting it in one of the money boxes here. If you get it in, you win that money. Now, that's round one. Let's try this one, and then round two, we're gonna twist it up and make it crazy. Okay, let's roll and see what you get. Oh, oh no! Are you kidding me? Oh, I got a box. You're, You're done. done. Yeah, you can't so like I can't get to that, I get squat, right? You're okay, done. you don't wanna go in there now, you get zero. You saw it. I thought, for sure. Can I, I, I have a I was lopsided. Okay, I know. Go. So I gave Ty a cookie that was lopsided because I figured if you tried to go I'm straight, the it would go flying off the. Oh! What? Dude, this is too easy. Jake's just broken half. And yeah. then both went to this. I don't think this cookie's usable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's literally broken half and landed right where it needs to be to be. Oh, I want the fifth. Okay, so you got the 20. Oh, I'm going for the 50. Alright, I'm just going for the 50. I'm not going to get anything. How <laughs> am I? You can get nothing. I'm gonna shoot for the 50. Oh, it's getting I'm gonna get the one right down the middle. Oh, you just chip. I know, mine's lopsided. Oh! oh. oh. You really get nothing. The kids made it look so easy. All right, Katie. I'm gonna You've got me. two out of the five spots. Let's see her strategy. That's exactly the strategy I did, and I didn't do nothing. And you can't, like, push it. You just uh, My mom just shatters for no reason. 
Uh, oh, you got it nothing. Okay, so on the table left is a 50 and a 1. That was the reward round. Are you guys ready for the punishment yep, round? Yep, I get to go first. <laughs> I get to go second then. All right, those who went last go first, and those who went yes! first go last. No! <laughs> yeah! Yes! That's only fair. And in this punishment round, though, you don't take away the punishment. People can get the same punishment over and over again, because we're not going to take them away. Let me get the punishment set up, and then we'll start round two. Okay, for round two, everybody's getting new cookies. I don't want to go with the Because they old think one. that's going to help. Well, if you go with the old Here's one. the categories. If you land in this bin, you get sour cream. If you land in this bin, you're gonna get whole grain mustard. Now this is kind of spicy and it's gross. If you land in this one, you get Cool Whip. So that's the one you're gonna want. Yeah. Unless you wanna land in this one and you get garlic, minced garlic. <laughs> or you can land in this one and you could get buffalo sauce Oreos. By itself? Oh, what? All right, so I've never had buffalo Oreos or garlic or even whipped. I have never had any of these toppings on my Oreos. This is gonna be an original Oreo flavor. And hey, if they're good, Maybe Oreo will start selling them. We'll see. All right. Uh, see how Katie went last? She gets to go first. Now remember, we don't remove these. I'm going to go closer to the blue line, hoping to get the. All right, she's not the trying to blue again. Color. Let's see what happens. Oh, 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 are you kidding me? Yes, All right. No. Katie gets. You're not going to use the one that you rolled? No. I mean, we're not supposed to be wasting food this month, but I don't want to. Eat one that's been dirty. I'm eating the clean one. That looks like an elegant Oreo. Look at my elegant Oreo. Oh, it's more whipped cream than Oreo. This would be a nice little order of pitcher on a silver Oreo. platter. All right, I don't know so how to eat this. Yeah. <laughs> it's go good. Next, my turn. I'm gonna try a different stretch. I'm gonna go diagonal. Diagonal. Yep. And he's gonna get that scarlet. No. It would go right down in the middle and mine were king. But it has you got the wings sauce. I get buffalo wild wings Oreo. And I'm gonna eat the Oreo I rolled down the table. Mm -hmm. This is gonna probably be gross. Oh and look, gosh. we can't. Oh, it smells so much. Oh, it smells so good. It's so good on, on wings, yeah. not on Oreo. Oh, that's gonna be so it's gross. Stop. You gotta do a lot. You can't do just like a little dab and be like, hey, Imagine you your shirt so it works. Oh, yeah. Actually, it might match mine. What? Okay, here we go. This is gonna be strong. <laughs> gross. Scrumptious. Oh, I can smile. I am really grossed out right now. It's not a good mix. Zero out of ten. I love the sauce, but not with Oreos. That is disgusting. Okay, I'm trying to go for whipped cream. I'm going mom's. Okay. Here, new rule. If you don't get it in, player's choice would mix two together. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Audrey, don't make it in. <laughs> don't make it in, Audrey. <laughs> It's like you want to enjoy it because it's an Oreo, but you, you can't. I the think you do first, before you start chewing the Oreo, you just take all the stuff on the top with your tongue and start oh, it down. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, the sour cream probably chills the mustard a little bit. Sour cream is kind of a mild. <laughs> that mustard stinks. Hey, you gotta eat it. Get over here and eat it. Uh, no off camera sneaky sneaky. This is legit stuff. I'm trying! Yes, you can. Two, two, two. You can do it. I eat my Buffalo Wild Wing Oreo, which, by the way, uh, Oreo, do not make that one of your lines. You don't make those one either. All right. It's pretty much gone now. It's just Oreo. <laughs> What do you think the boys are gonna get? Okay. Team Jake, comment down below there. what you want Jake to get. So hashtag sour cream, mustard, whipped cream, whipped cream, garlic, God. or buffalo wild wings. Out of the bins. Oh, that was nasty. 
No splash zone. <laughs> so now we're gonna, we're gonna hide all that <laughs> garlic, which by the way, if you had smell vision, it would be so bad. One bite. All of it. Just go in. One bite. Just all of it. Ah. Go in. One bite. Just go. You chew, 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 chew. Fast, fast, fast. Chew, chew, chew. <laughs> Think whipped cream, whipped cream, whipped cream, whipped cream. Whipped cream, whipped cream. Garlic! <laughs> If not, you gotta get more. This is our meal. All right, man. he didn't spit out. He was like this close, but he's still got to I still have chunks mouth. of mustard yep. in my mouth. <laughs> okay, you did it. You did, did the whipped cream make a better day? Just took a little chunk. Okay, so so far, listen. Four people have used that strategy. Only one has worked. One has worked. Good luck. No! 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 Okay, I did a strategy as well. So I did that, but I put the lopsided one on the right so that. If it was going, it would go over to the right slightly instead of going to the left. There's strats in this game. I guess. All right, so this is a game that we just try to stay sane while we're eating all of our Ooh. rationed food. Have you had a snack today food? besides lunch? Maybe. What'd you have? Did you put on camera? You'll have to watch the video. Did you put on camera? I put on camera. Ty, did you eat a snack today besides this? Jake, did you? Nope. Audrey? Just kidding, you're not part. That was okay. What'd you eat today though? Hawaiian oh, meat snacks. Okay, I haven't had a snack either since lunchtime. This was our snack and I don't know what we're gonna do for dinner. We're gonna figure that out and then also breakfast for tomorrow morning. Anyway, we will come back at dinner time unless someone snacks. All right, update on snacks and food. Dinner time, I am cooking spaghetti. We got peas, we've got, uh oh. We've got burnt garlic bread. <laughs> I forgot to take it out. Oh, it smells so good. It's in there. Uh, we got spaghetti. I'm gonna make it either, you can either put the meat in it if you want the meat or if you want without the meat. And then, so what I've been snacking on, I chose to go with the other Mountain Dew. Didn't really want that Fruity Punch one again. And I may or may not have had one or two of these cookies as I was waiting for the dinner to cook. I mean, come on, if you're cooking dinner, I think you get to have a couple of snacks. So I did, but see, my problem is, is it not? Nighttime, that's when I get really, really snacky. So you might see a few more entries from me because that's just what I like to do. I know it's horrible, I shouldn't be doing it, but maybe you guys can help me break these habits. Alrighty, David made dinner, and this is the dinner he made and that we are all eating. So it's garlic bread, which we bought the bread several days ago. We had just had it in the fridge. Huh? And he made the garlic sauce for it, and then some pasta spaghetti, and some peas, frozen peas that we found oh, from the garden. Cake. You can try it. Ty's having a fruit cake flavor Mountain Dew. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, this is dinner. I think we're all pretty much having a soda and it's one of the some. Food groups. It's one of <laughs> Well, Jake, Jake and Ty did go by a lot. <laughs> so, we're all splurging. Funny story is when Spencer and I went shopping for our groceries, we pulled up right by Jake and Ty as they were putting in all the stuff and I saw chips and soda. <laughs> and I was like, oh boy, <laughs> good luck. Yes. <laughs> we had to dig in the freezer to be able to find these peas. I don't know if we have any more left, but you know what? We'll worry about that later. We're gonna enjoy today. Aha. Uh -huh. Did you record you were eating snacks? Yeah. Yeah, right. So I knew it. I was upstairs, I thought, the boys are too quiet. I bet if I go down there, there would be snacks because they always snack as they play on the computer. Look, you can see like little remnants of snack stuff here. That, their keyboard, I bet if I dumped it over, there'd be snacks on it, huh? What else have you eaten besides the goldfish? Just that. Thai? And pizza. And pizza? Yeah, we, we, we all ate pizza. All right, but you've had no snacks since lunch. Ty? I haven't. Yes, you did. No. I don't believe you. Whoa, what is this? <laughs> a bag of chips? Yeah. Wait, and a bag of pretzels? Jacob, did you record you were eating snacks? Yeah. Guys, you're supposed to record. 
record everything that you're eating. This is the challenge for the day. <laughs> All right, so let's look. How many chips are left in that bag? Let's see, reach in there. Just Boy. crumbs. <laughs> so you ate the whole bag? Yeah. Dude, how Rock many pretzels. How many pretzels are in there? Just the salt. Wait. You eat the whole bag of pretzels as well? I got the chicken a little bit more than me. Okay, so pretzels definitely make you thirsty. What drinks have you had? Uh, not much. What? I've had a soda for lunch and dinner, but besides that, I haven't really drinking anything else. Okay, you need to go drink a glass of water. You're gonna get like dehydrated. Same with you, go drink a glass of water. Oh my gosh, I thought I snacked at nighttime. I don't think I've ever said, wait, I see another tie. Right, what's that? What is that? Uh, Over there. That was before, right that was before, that was from yesterday. That's yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. So that's a whole bag of Takis. It's not empty, it's, not, it's barely been touched. <laughs> Jeez. All right, I was actually very concerned that I would be the only one that would be like snacking, but it looks like everybody is snacking. So what does that mean? That means I could go get me some snacks. So I'm gonna go grab some snacks and go partake. I just don't know what I want right now. It's like, it's 7.30 at night. It's like I want cookies and milk. Cookies and milk sound good. I'm going with cookies and milk. As promised, here's my cookies. I have six cookies right here. And these are from Pepperidge Farm. I really like these. We have a Pepperidge Farm factory here just not too far away but I like these because it's got like jam already in the middle and then it's like a uh, what is a kind of a cookie is this is this kind of like a uh, shortbread? yeah kind of a shortbread cookie with jam and then of course you got to have your glass of milk because cookies course. go with milk Audrey's over there I saw her with another Mountain Dew but no, she says that's the it, original Mountain Dew yeah I didn't have to because this is fruit cake flavor Mountain Dew you think I have two of these I know they're not that good yeah they're <laughs> interesting though. Yeah. It's kind of like a fruit punch, but yet kind of about, I don't know. So I just know they're playing Sims. Of course. Because it's like the thing that her and Katie do now. Because so. once you get into Sims mood, you have to play. I guess. So far, this particular challenge hasn't been too bad, but it's gonna be this way for the rest of the month. So it's gonna get harder. Day one, not bad. But I have a bad feeling I'm gonna run out of my cookies by day five. <laughs> so I don't think there's that many left. And we ruined about a dozen of my Oreo cookies. So to be determined on if I make it, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, it's eight o'clock. Don't judge. This is when I get snacky. Nighttime is when I have a hard time controlling myself. Oh, come on. I know you do it too. I know you do it too. Good morning, everyone. So it is breakfast time and Jake and I are checking in because Jake and I get up at the same time. He gets off to school. I try to help him with breakfast if he needs it. If not, he gets it himself. Today, we're having toast and bacon. That's pretty much the breakfast Jake and I have every morning. We like to have just toast and bacon. <laughs> I don't know. And <laughs> you're having Oreos? And my water. Only because you just saw them on the counter. Yeah, I figured somebody else was in here eating them. I thought it was funny. So if we don't do toast and bacon, I like to have granola. I'm trying to think of what Jake eats when he doesn't eat toast. I don't think the camera's picking this up, but this room is filled with bacon. Yeah, somewhere. I've been cooking uh. bacon and it's quite smoky in here, so I gotta air it out. Jake, what do you like to eat for breakfast when you don't eat toast? Quesadillas. Yeah, that's right. The boys, Ty for sure will want a cheese quesadilla when he wakes up. Um, he does that pretty much every morning, but we're gonna run out of tortillas, so we'll see about that. Ty's still sleeping, Jake's gotta get off to school, so he's gotta hurry and eat his breakfast, and then I guess, yeah, we'll check in. Okay, so my breakfast, I, re I don't really wanna eat breakfast right now, so I have a Lunchable and a soda. And I might also get an apple, because I don't think the Lunchable will fill me up. So yeah, that's my breakfast. Alrighty guys, that wraps up, I think, our what we eat in a day for 24 hours. I think everybody has recorded their breakfast. David doesn't normally eat breakfast. He did come and grab the cookies, but I don't think he even ate the cookies. He just doesn't eat breakfast. <laughs> so, Ty doesn't normally eat a Lunchables. He does normally eat a quesadilla, but this is pretty much what we would eat in a day. Anyway, on to the next challenge. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.